how to fix FPS drop in Valorant. So if you're experiencing any kind of performance issues, this could be input lag or FPS drops or just basically any performance issues in general, I'm going to show you a few optimization settings to go and fix all of these issues. Now we're going to start with some settings in Valorant and then we're going to move on to some computer settings. So from your settings page, we're just going to start by clicking on this video tab and then we need to click on general. Now the first thing is you want to make sure your display mode is set to full screen and then you need to come down to limit FPS on battery and go and turn this off. You also want to disable limit FPS in menus, limit FPS in background should also be off and if you have an Nvidia graphics card on your computer you want to make sure reflex low latency is set to on and boost. Once you've done that click on graphics quality. Now the multi-threaded rendering we're going to turn this on all of these different quality levels we're going to reduce to low. The Vingetta we're going to turn off and V-Sync also turn off as well. Now the anti-aliasing should be set to MSAA two times. And for anisotropic filtering, we need to go and set this to four times. Now all of these settings at the bottom should be turned off like so. And then you can go in and save all of these changes. Now already that should have made a massive difference with your FPS. But now we're going to move on to some optimization settings on your Windows computer. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu. Go and search for the word settings and click on this window here. In the left hand side, select system. Click on display and then scroll down to graphics. Click on advanced graphics graphic settings and typically you want to have hardware accelerated GPU scheduling turned on. Now in some rare cases this can actually make your FPS worse so you'll just need to go and test the game with this on and off and work out which option gives you a better FPS. We're then going to scroll down to our list of applications and you need to locate Valorant. Click on the drop down arrow and make sure your GPU preference is set to your high performance Nvidia card. You can then go and select gaming from the left hand side and click on game bar. Make sure the game bar is turned off like this and then come back over to the previous window. Click on game mode and this should be turned on and enabled and this will give you the best performance on your Windows computer. Now the last thing we need to do to get the maximum FPS possible is to open up the start menu. Go and search for control panel and click on this window here. Over in the top right hand side make sure view by is set to large icons and then click on power options. Now for the different plans we need to go and make sure high performance mode is selected like this. You can then save these changes and close out of this window. You can head inside of a Valorant game and you should now have the best performance possible. Let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful.